Hey guys, welcome back. Today's a really good day. We have an old red line. So here we have a red line Pro Styler from around 1986. Right now it has a Pro Neck on it. Looks like it was orange, a lot of paint coming off it. And it's got the POTS mod. These are the red line forks that came with the frame. Otherwise, everything else is missing. So we're going to go through all of the parts. These are the Redline 48 wheels. And then we have a 1-inch gyro, a seat post, an Odyssey clamp, Haro pedals, Redline flight sprocket, toadstool grips, white wall tires, Tech 77 levers, an American bottom bracket, the GT bars that came on the bike, redline flight cranks, and then this is kind of cool, this seat. So you turn this latch, you can actually tuck the seat in so it disappears. So that's kind of a cool design. So let's get to the build, and I'm sure it's going to look really, really cool, so let's see how it goes.
Woods here we have this crazy awesome Redline Pro Styler. This thing is beautiful. I'm really digging the white walls. So let's go through all the parts. First of all, we have the ODI Toadstools, made in USA. The Tech 77 lever with the button. These are the GT Performer bars from the 80s with a gyro. The Pro Neck stem with the POTS mod. We put a new gyro and headset. These are the Odyssey 99 brakes with the original Redline forks and the Redline pegs. This is the Redline hub with the original rims. And check out these white wall tires. Moving over to the middle, we have the Haro Fusion DX Shimano pedals with the Redline flight crank and Redline sprocket, a KMC chain. The original Odyssey seat clamp and a no-name post with this crazy seat once again. It locks down. Really cool. Haven't seen that one before. Moving to the back, the Odyssey 1999 brakes and the white wall tire. So I think this is our first red line that we've built up. Let us know if you've had a red line from the 80s, 90s early 2000s maybe even something now make sure you comment like share and subscribe and thanks for watching the video